you do a lot of polar coordinates or anything where you're going to use the comma key, is it shifted on the Casio, on the sharp it is uh, on the main keyboard. So let's say we want to do a conversion from pole or from rectangular to polar. On the Casio it's a little different logic, but it, you say I want to polarize is what I would say. So I want the polar coordinates from the rectangular coordinate of 3 and then I hit shift comma 4 and then I hit equal and there you go. The polar coordinates of 3 comma 4 would be 5, radius of 5 and an angle of 53 degrees in sum. On the sharp you do 3 comma 4, there's no shift or anything and then it has this arrow pointing to an R theta so shift R theta and it gives the answer it's interesting to note it puts it on two lines. The Sharp does that a lot, whereas the Casio tends to put things on a single line. I'm sure there are pros and cons of that. You can be the judge.